Man, it sure would be nice if I can take a vacation to America, but the flights right now are so expensive and the yen to dollar rate is crazy. Uh, if there was just a way I can maybe go to America without leaving Japan. Wait a minute, maybe there is a way. So here I am in Fusa, which is right next to the American Yokota Air Base. Supposedly there's a base street or something right next to it with uh, lots of shops and restaurants that are very Americanized, I guess. From the pictures I saw, it seemed like it's like old 50s style American atmosphere. So that seemed interesting and I think it's the closest that I'll get to going to America anytime soon. So let's check it out. I ran into this sign. It says the Fusa American house is open. Uh, I read that this place is a old um, base housing that was repurposed as a museum, but it was closed during COVID. But now it's open. I guess we're here, Fusa Base Side Street. It is the first week of January, but I have to mention that Fusa is home to one of these shops, the Blue Seal Ice Cream Shops. Uh, they're an ice cream brand from Okinawa. Pretty good. If, I think I've tried it before, but uh, if you want to try Blue Seal Ice Cream in Tokyo, this is one place you can. I can say one thing for sure, it doesn't feel like Japan here. street actually spans for a couple blocks here here's the one bagel place hoop fresh bagels and cafe if the bagels are authentic I might come in and pick some up on the way back but back there is the Goose American house so I'm gonna go check it out uh, they're closed they lied. They're open, but they're closed. <clears throat> but um, at least I can see the exterior, I guess. So they're closed for New Year's, maybe. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, national holidays. Uh, it's not a holiday today. <laughs> That's why they're not open. I didn't even notice the little Statue of Liberty that's here. <laughs> that's pretty neat. This place looks pretty interesting. A bunch of neat trinkets. So it's about one o'clock now and I'm getting pretty hungry. Uh, I read up online about this little like food court area that has like pizza and donuts and tacos and stuff. And uh, I looked it up and it's a little bit further down. So let's take a walk. Okay, 
I think I walk about four or five blocks. There should be a little like food truck, food court area around here. I found a spot, but looks like most of the trucks are closed. There does seem like there's one, so let's check that place out. I don't know what they have, but I'm hungry, so probably good with anything. All right, so most of the places are closed, but the pizza place is open. Pizza! And that place is called Doskoi Pizza. Apparently they're pretty popular on the base. I got two slices, waiting for them to uh, warm them up. Got a Coke. That's a decent sized Coke. I did want to try these tacos. Maybe next time. Right, I got me pizzas. I got a pepperoni and a jalapeno one. New York style. Looks pretty good. Thin crust. They even had a uh, garlic powder and pepper flakes. So, yum. Pizza. Mm. Crust is crunchy. Oh, that's really good. Recommendable. I'm pretty full for now. Uh, those two slices actually did fill me up. I got to talk to the, the owner of the pizza place. He seemed like a cool dude. He said he goes to like Oregon for a business trip sometimes after I told him that uh, I grew up in Washington. Hawaii. This area has a very unique vibe of like it's a mixture of retro America and Japan kind of mashed together it's kind of a I don't know it feels really different from anything I've felt before I guess 
like not quite Japan, not quite America. It's almost like me almost. <laughs> Ike's car insurance, but it looks like Ike's car insurance. <clears throat> I think the streets themselves just line like this. Feels very not Japan, to me at least. I don't know how you're supposed to read this. Is it D mode or demo day diner? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be demo day. Hello, soldier. Keep up the good work. All right, I'm gonna head back to where I started now. I grab some ice cream and maybe some bagels and call it for today. Ooh, cheese bagels. I'm still full from the pizza, so I grabbed some bagels to go to eat later. Most of the selection was already gone, but I was able to get an everyth everything bagel, which is like impossible to find here. And a basil cheese bagel. So, I hope they're good because bagels in Japan typically aren't done very well. So, hopefully these are legit. Yeah, for being January 4th, it's actually pretty warm, so let's grab some ice cream. Okay, I got my ice cream. I waited a bit in there because it was actually, there was actually a line for the ice cream. I was thinking of maybe getting the Okinawa special ice cream, but since today I'm here to enjoy America, I got mint chocolate chip, so I'm happy with my decision. Alright guys, thank you for following me along as I adventure through Fusa area next to the Yokota Air Base. It was definitely a interesting fusion of Japanese and American cultures along this street, but I hope you liked it. Again, this area is not too far from central Tokyo. It only took about an hour-ish from Shinjuku, so I will be eating my ice cream as I head back to the station. But thanks for watching again. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.